By the way, so this morning, I'm watching Fox News. And they had some people on, and these were Democrats that voted for Trump. And they've had this on. And, and so far, if anything, they've gotten even more committed. But they had a man on this morning. They had a man on this morning who was a Democrat his whole life. He voted as a Democrat. But he voted for, I say us, I don't say me. He voted for us in the last election, 2016. And they said to him, so if the election were held now again, what would you do? And he effectively said, man, would I vote for Trump again even faster. So his name is Gino DeFabio. And where is Dino? Gino, get over here, Gino. Whoa. Gino DeFabio. Yes. You know, anybody who knows me, friends of mine, people who love me, it's worse for them. But they know how it's been since President Trump started running for the, with the election. How much I supported this guy, how much I love this guy. I said, this guy's got something. He's the real deal. Everybody else, everybody else came and they says, oh, we're going to fight for you. We're fighting for you. Well, this, this is Youngstown, Mr. President. But this is also the Steel Valley. Every one of these people love you, sir. And I, and, I, and I don't want to sound silly or anything, but I thought, what would I say to the president if I ever got to meet him, which this is an honest to God over the top moment for me. I thought, you know, I'm just going to ask to tell him something. And sir, like I said, thank you for Justice Gorsuch on the Supreme Court. Right? That, 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 say, that started it all. And then, and then I apologize. I said, Mr. President, thank you for Melania. Could we have a better, could we have a more outstanding first lady? I'm probably going to be in trouble with my wife, but God bless that woman. And then I, and then the last thing I said, and I don't think he thought I was going to take this much time, but anybody that knows me, this is going to happen. I said, thank you, sir, for keeping the promises that you made to these 12,000 people and to the country. And my recommendation, sir, look what you could do in, in, the, in, the, in the bastion of the, of the Democratic Party. I don't think there's anybody except Cuyahoga uh, County that's more Democratic voters than us. Look what you could draw. I'd go back to Washington. I would tell the Republicans and the Democrats, sir, Look, I'm going to go do my rallies. You got the agenda. Those people are voting for me and mine. Do what you want. Pass my agenda, or we're going, we're going on the road. Thank you, sir. It, I can't tell you. Sir, I can't tell you. It's an absolute, absolute honor. Thank you, sir. Thank you. You are fantastic. Thank you, Gino.